Back with the bad game. Don't know what part this is, but <coughs> it's just back with the bad game. Like it's just back with the bad game. We're in to open up all that's to do. Only like two things in there right now. Let's open this one. <coughs> Half of these are for the woman superstar. Hmm, what else? What else? What else? Hmm. I think I'm just gonna keep buying the gear packs. Buy them. I'm gonna buy one. <coughs> if I don't get something good of any of these, then I'm going to not do it. Okay, that elbow pad good. Tattoo sucks. Face paint, never gonna use it. Uh, hair good. Nothing else is good. I'm getting so many women things when I don't. I want to use the guy character. Even though the guy character's storyline sucks, I still want to use him. Okay, let's just spam the crap out of this. I literally spent, I literally spent so many points just to get these tokens. Four. Okay, let's do this. <clears throat> the brass is basically what my characters are using. Just, it's like bigger. That's basically what my character is using. AJ Styles. Mm, I like the boots, but mm, that doesn't count. Cause I, I just like the boots. Cause like you can change the colors to really good. The jacket. Let's all be honest. Who even uses that jacket unless they're making a creepy character? <clears throat> God, it's like nine in the morning, so wrestling the wrestling tights count. I like them. Now after we do a little bit more, then then we'll buy more. But we're on chapter fourteen. And if it doesn't save if it doesn't save if it saved me and Drew's match, then that means that, <clears throat> then that means, that means that, Samoa Joe attacked me. Bruh, if it did not save it, I'm gonna be so mad because it's, because freaking Drew is, he sucks in this game, but still pretty good. Ah, oh, dang it. They didn't save it. You guys are going to see my new attire. Oh, wait. It's up. The following count. Boy, there we go. Set up. Eat you right there. Oh, boy. Those man is just making it easy. Boom. And this knee doesn't do it. Like, it does barely any damage, but it's so cool. Oh, you didn't make it. Off that rope. Boom. We. We. Go to the top. Uh, Velveteen Dream. I remember when you had to buy the thing just to beat him. So retarded. We. Um.
is almost at red health. Bruh, this man has not touched me once. That's what I want to talk about. How Drew has not touched me once. I am straight up balling. Like, let me miss it. Now this probably is gonna get him close to right here. Oh, well it did. Okay. Okay. Yeah, this is where this is where oh, straight and blows and the headbutt. The headbutt by Drew. And now he's acting like a retard. Oh, Trey moving out the way, and the ref's down, DDT, and the cover on Drew, one, two, three. Wait a second, that's the boy Joe, oh, with a medal. He was fired six or seven years ago after the shocking loss to Trey, oh my God. He's got turn that on. Sabo Joe is back though. Oh It has not been six or seven years, it's been more like two months. It's been two one two three ding ding ding. And now she's gonna get mad at me. Or it's gonna be the Hall of Fame soon. Most likely. See, the bracer, the New Day bracer, is exactly what she's wearing. Just I put it in a different color. It's exactly what she's wearing. I don't know why you have to unlock it. Different version, because the only thing it adds is one more line. Because it's in the same same color that I take it. I'm going to go so much to come. Yeah. I got freaking poop. I got freaking If only security had done their jobs that night, Samoa Joe never would have made it past the arena's metal detector. Sorry, just trying to keep it positive. Which is hard to do because our story wouldn't be complete without talking about one giant negative. I'm referring, of course, to the arrival of the American hero, Brooklyn Von Braun in WWE. Because of Brooklyn, our lives and careers would never be the same. Although if you think about it, they were pretty much the same as they'd always been because no matter where we went or what we accomplished, we could never escape Brooklyn's loud, obnoxious shadow. We gave Brooklyn a lot of chances to prove she had changed. Well, mostly yeah, traded. Yeah. But ultimately, she only proved one thing. She was the exact same bully she was way back when we were in high school. And she wasn't just a jerk to us. She disrespected anyone she dealt with, including WWE legends.
somewhat lower than the front part, but Is that all you've got? It feels like you're taking a teacup poodle for a walk yeah. on my back. <laughs> Excuse me, Miss um, Von Braun. Can we talk? Kind of Can't you see I'm conducting important GM business? The, Come on, like, I really need you to get in there. Now. Work it. It will only take a minute. What? Yeah. I don't want my car washed or candy from your stupid kids like fundraiser or whatever crap you know, you're selling. Actually, I'm the original kind of American or hero, or Kurt Angle. You know, the Hall of Famer you borrowed so your nickname from without asking. Come back in five so with stronger hands. So what do you want? An autograph from the real American hero? A picture? Tell me what I need to do to make you go away. I need you to drop the lawsuit against me. If you don't, it will bankrupt my family. No chance. I'm the way more famous American hero, and I will not allow you to continue profiting off my celebrity. I won a gold medal for my country with a broken freaking neck. What have you ever done that makes you an American hero? Uh, filed a trademark? Security! Wait. Maybe we can settle this without lawyers. If there's anything that could change your mind, I'd do it. Anything? It just so happens we have a superstar who was gone for a very long time and needs to knock off some ring rust. So I'll drop the lawsuit if you can beat Samoa Joe. But Joe's a monster. He's got that bionic arm that could tear me apart. And I haven't competed in years. Samoa Joe hasn't competed in years either, so it should be a competitive match. Good luck. I don't want to be doing anything worse. So I said, let's just hold off and not put it on The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, weighing in at 237 pounds, Kurt Angle. And his opponent from Huntington Beach, California, weighing in was. at 282 pounds, Samoa Joe. I just realized this. Samoa Joe might not be a ne in the next game as playable character since what he since like he's he actually has been gone for a long time. And, when he came back, he's been mostly like an announcer or a commentator. I mean, an announcer or just like a manager. So, most likely he's not going to be in the early game. I'm going to whoop you with a suit. Suit play. Belly to belly. Come on. I still have a broken neck surgery. Ah. Oh. Bruh. <laughs> this game. I'm just going to break some Mojo's neck. As best of my ability. How am I half injured, but Samojo hasn't touched me? 
That's the first time he's actually even got hit on me. Bruh, okay. That arm does a lot of damage. I see why it's so hard to beat him. Oh, oh, the neck go on my penis. Oh god. That probably did not feel too good. Oh, oh, oh. Boom. Cap on the ground. What's going to happen? It's his own, it's Trey. There, there's my new attire. Roll up cover, Kurt wins, Kurt wins one. Well, actually, she never said that so we can't get involved. She said that he, that Kurt has to beat Samoa Joe. And technically, all I did was interfere. And I just distracted him. That is a wrong. Since you like getting involved in my business so much, maybe you should pay all the legal bills for the lawsuit I have to drop now. Yeah? Well, you messed with us in the best of five series, and that cost Red her title. So I'd say we're even now. Is that what you think happened? I signed Samoa Joe because he was unfairly let go from WWE, not to mention he's a great addition to the roster. But I had nothing to do with him costing you the series. I don't control him. No one can. Which is something you should be very worried about. So if you're not out to get us... Then prove it. Give me a rematch for my championship that I lost without ever being pinned. Let me think about that. No. That's what I thought. But what I will do is give the audience something new and fresh. Trey, you're going to face Adam Cole next week for his WWE Championship in a no disqualification match. See? Maybe I'm not so bad after all. Now if you'll excuse me, I need to go find someone else I can sue to recoup my losses. After this the following match, contest! I know what's going to happen. Not that hard. So I'm not just going to get involved. I never seven years I thought I would see him as a really champ. I think I would see him as SmackDown Live tag team champions and then if he was on Raw since like all the competition's gone I see him as a US champ on Raw.
My mic hits out. Introducing the tough book, so don't worry about. Don't worry about. Don't worry about. Yeah, I know what's going on. Um, um, Dodge it. Well, actually, guys, I'm in the recording there, and next time we'll continue. So. Peace.